Hi, good morning. Uh, today is July 30, 2015 here in the Philippines and this morning at 10.30 a.m. Um, Metro Manila will have uh, an earthquake drill. Uh, it's like a region-wide uh, earthquake drill um, called MM Shake Drill. That's the hashtag that we're using. And I'm here in UP Diliman in Quezon City. This is a campus of the University of the Philippines. And this was this is tagged as one of the evacuation centers for our quadrant of our for this quadrant of our region. Okay, I'm here in one of the highest points in UP Diliman and I'm gonna see if this is a viable site for an emergency uh, two meter uh, uh, base station. Okay, there's a basketball court here. Uh, I can set up a small shack uh, somewhere there in that shade or uh, maybe under a tree. I'll be setting up, uh, I think it's a 15 foot mast. I'm gonna show it to you later. It's surrounded by buildings and a couple of trees. I don't think this is a very good spot for ham for ham radio. I think I have to scout for more locations. Oh by the way, I'm um, I'm I'm participating in one of the radio clubs um, exercises wherein uh, we transmit purely on off-grid uh, power supplies like batteries, um, solar panels, and that's what we're testing later. Uh, we're gonna send uh, some pre-coded messages or pre-formatted messages which are very brief and we're gonna see how far we can go with our setups. Here's another location in the UP Diliman campus where I think it's a good place to set up uh, an emergency ham radio station. There's a tree there somewhere here where I can um, sit and there's a little platform up there where I can set up my tripod. Okay, so here I am with all my uh, radio stuff. I'm carrying a 40, an NS40 car battery. It's the smallest car battery I can find. And in my backpack is um, the radio, the cables, my ground mat. Because it just rained the morning before this, so uh, the ground is very wet. So here I am uh, setting up my light stand. It's a 9 foot light stand used for studio lights. Okay, here's my DIY, DIY quarter wave antenna, which, which has gauge 14 solid wire ground radials. The center element is, or the main element is a brass rod which is slightly shorter than 19 inches I measured the SWR using that so I didn't really rely on the internet uh, standard recommendation of 19.5 inches so that's my regular light stand I put a one half inch curtain rod inside it to extend the height some more the rod is around 5 feet long and the light stand is 9 feet high for a total length of around 14 feet so here I am attaching my DIY power distribution box to the to the battery uh, using regular car battery terminals Okay, when you're tightening the bolts, make sure that your pliers or your wrench won't short out the two terminals. Just be sure about that. 
Okay, that's my mobile radio. It's an ICOM IC2300 hotel. Which can put out a maximum of 65 watts. And I'm attaching a blower that I mounted under the radio. Check the SWR at 25 watts and see uh, if it's safe to transmit there. Okay, 3, 2, 1. DW1 Yankee Golf Quebec. Good morning. Wow, that's good SWR. Considering that it's ugly, an ugly antenna. Alright, gotta go. So here's my antenna setup. It's I estimated to be around 14 feet above ground. And this is also one of the highest places in UP Diliman, although not the highest. I chose to be here instead of the highest place because uh, in the video I showed you earlier, uh, there are lots of buildings surrounding that area, and here it's mostly clear. So there, I put a logo. I actually, I just I, I put a signage. I just did that, so the campus security won't ask me what I'm doing. Maybe they'll ask me, but I have something to show them, and this is legit business. There's my. Uh, and you can see the oblation somewhere there I think they're gonna hold earthquake drills there as well later maybe that's what I'll report during the traffic uh, the shake drill traffic later all right see you guys so I'm calling uh, any station who would like to make the report minutes since we started the radio drill for the Metro Manila Shake drill and so far our net controller got 14 stations um, 12 of those which I copied uh, my farthest contact or my farthest uh, listening station is in Cabuyao Laguna I'll check later when I get home how far that is uh, so far I'm uh, I'm pretty happy with my setup and I hope I never get to use this in real life in a real emergency situation okay see you later well now I'm back at home and remember I told you earlier that I don't mind carrying this battery for long walks well I'm wrong um, after I walk back to the car for half a kilometer when I put this battery in the trunk of the car, my shoulders were aching. If I want to transport this for long distances, either I have to put it in a backpack for equal weight distribution or uh, mount it on my bike or maybe just get a smaller pack. I think, wait, let's see how much this thing weighs. Okay. It's out. 11 kilos or around 24 pounds okay yeah it's heavy i hope uh, you learned something i hope you got entertained with my video till my next video bye